The nominations are now official. Ursula von der Leyen, from the centre-right European People's Party, has been endorsed for a second term as the European Commission's president. Thursday also saw former Portuguese Prime Minister António Costa of the Socialists and Democrats endorsed for the role of EU Council President and Estonian Prime Minister Kaya Kalas of the Centrist Renew Europe as the EU's foreign policy high representative. It comes after six leaders, who also represent the EPP, S&D or Renew, agreed on a draft deal on the three names, a deal denounced by the Hungarian Prime Minister on Thursday in a post on social media. The EPP built a coalition of lies and deceit with the socialists and the liberals. We cannot and will not support this shameful agreement. This is not what the European people voted for. Accusing her fellow leaders of behaving like oligarchs, Italian Prime Minister Giorgia Maloney also criticised the deal. Some claim to decide for everyone, both for those on the opposite political side and for those of nations considered too small to be worthy to sit at the tables that count. Maloney leads the right-wing European Conservatives and Reformists bloc, which took Renew's place as the third largest group in the European Parliament after elections earlier this month. According to EU diplomats, she abstained from the vote on von der Leyen, but voted against Costa and Calas for their jobs.